Okay, so I see the number in the standard today is also quite a bit low. But uh, since it, we've already been uh, informed that it's time for stand up, I think we'll just uh, continue. So I'll be hosting today's standoff. I know this is new for you guys, just something different. We are in uh, week five, we are halfway there. Maybe, so just a few announcements from uh, Ten Academy team. Uh, you've all received um, emails for one-on-ones. Those, these are our first one-on-ones. They will be happening uh, this week. Just ensure that you actually actually signed up for a time. They'll be running. Um, they'll be running for most of the day. So something else, the contracts uh, that you are asked to submit from the classroom, they are due today. So just make sure that you actually sign your contract and um, deliver it by today. Another announcement is um, deposits. Uh, if the deposits should also be made by today. If you need uh, any information, if you're going to pay by card, you can just email train at 10 Academy for more information. Okay, so if there's uh, any other announcements from the 10 Academy team, I think we can take them now before we just go ahead to the stand up. Anyone? Everest, I, think I, think those, I think those were quite essential and essential for the announcements. I think those were the ones in my end, I think. Okay, thank you, Everest. Uh, those will be the announcements for now. So we'll just uh, go straight into the stand up. We'll just, just as normal. And we want to know what have you been doing, how far you are, any challenges or blockers you've had while doing um, your assignments, and maybe how are you in terms of uh, making it for tomorrow's deadline. You can also mention a little bit on career assignments because it's actually worrying that this week less than half of you have actually engaged with the career assignment. So if when you're giving your stand up, just mention a little bit on how you're doing with the career assignment, if you've done it, if you've not done it, and uh, maybe what's causing that. So we can take uh, volunteers just to ensure we have everyone from group one to group five. We can start the stand up now. Anyone? Yes, Martin. Okay, uh, thank you for uh, that. Uh, so, <clears throat> on my side, I've been, uh, together with my team, we have been working on uh, ensuring that everything is in place uh, on the technical side. That is ensuring that uh, we are able to uh, complete the, the dashboard, uh, the deployment. So today, actually, what you wanted to do is deploy everything we've done because uh, we have completed on the side of uh, the modeling. Uh, we, we, if there are any changes, it's just uh, some bit of improvements on it. Uh, on the side of the front end, uh, uh, we've also been able to complete. So it's just deploying it and being able to now track the changes and uh, being able to see how it works uh, while it's online. The next thing is uh, on the careers assignments, uh, I, I actually, started uh, working on it uh, yesterday. I was, uh, I was going through it uh, and uh, just concerning how uh, we should, the, way, the, the, the sort of questions we should be looking forward to or things we should be looking forward for the next uh, coming uh, weeks and uh, how we should prepare ourselves. Uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to that and I, I hope that uh, everything will be all right. Yeah, thank you. Okay, thank you, Martin. That's nice to hear that your group is your group is actually ahead. So, before I take from, uh, I think that's Nados. Is there anyone else from Group Three who can add uh, anything to what Martin has said? Anyone else from Group Three? Martin, I just wanted to also ask a question. Um, okay. So, you, but you didn't write your questions down in preparation for the one-on-one. -on -one, so, why is that? Okay. 
That's a question for Martin. Okay. Uh, yesterday, uh, there was I was I was going I was a bit up and down just uh, ensuring that I had uh, the money for the payment. So that was why I de delayed a bit. Okay. I mean, the reason we ask people to write it down is it's it's one thing to think it through, but if if I look at the submissions, they're super well done. Um, and I see a sort of organization of thought, and that comes through writing it down. So I would really encourage everyone. We've uh, it's a lot of effort to take the one on one, um, and this the feedback is most useful. If you've also, if you want answers to specific questions, um, anyone who's looking to come to the one on one and just to be told what to do, it's okay. But you'll get a lot further, and this is not only for the training, but especially once you get to work. You want to enter a meeting with your manager having an idea of where you're doing well, where you're not doing well. And if you just show up to a meeting and say, look, tell me what to do, it's 20% as good as saying, this is where I think I'm doing well, this is where I think I'm weak. Um, let's discuss priorities. So I would really encourage everyone, it's not marked, but it's for your own benefit. So the mark is irrelevant, but the learning process is most relevant. So please do write it down. Okay, thank you, Aaron, for that. I hope anyone else who had not uh, indicated their questions on the one-on-one, -on -one, they've gotten the importance of actually doing that. So, Rafa, I'd also seen your hand up. You're also from Group 3. You have anything to add on what Martina said and probably give us an update on your career's assignment? Yeah. Hi, Anastasia, Aaron, and everyone. Morning. I just want to add about what Aaron said and this uh, for the assignment, career assignment, uh, because it wasn't really like, um, for me, I just saw the deadline, it seems to say it's today, and I didn't really get it, and until it was like, uh, you know, uh, I found now it says missing, because I thought it was just we will ask on the, on the meeting itself, uh, so yeah, I mean, it was just somehow, maybe it wasn't very clear, Sure. No, I mean, I mean that's fine. But um, so forget about the assignment. What's much more important mm -hmm. is that everyone develops the um, discipline that when you're entering a meeting, let's let's pretend this is a meeting with your manager. Don't go into these meetings cold. You need to go in prepared, and the preparation needs to include um, how am I doing and the ability to ask good questions. Um, you should. Everyone should have those meetings, those questions prepared, and their self evaluation prepared. So all of you will be working, all of you will have these meetings. This is the start of that preparation. And I don't want anyone to go into these meetings cold. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you, Rafa. Do you have anything to add uh, that is related to the challenge? Maybe what you've been doing from your side? How do you feel working with the group? Okay, that's it. So it's like, um, um, as we are dividing the task, um, more or less, I'm just uh, I'm focusing on the dashboard building the stream lab. Uh, and yeah, I mean, it's it's kind of because the challenge is somehow too big, and now um, I'm trying to really understand uh, if the whole project. But yeah, I mean, it's it's a little bit difficult. So, yeah. Okay, so when you say you're trying to understand the project, what are you doing? Are you working with your group members and uh, why is it difficult? Because uh, Martin actually gave like the group was going great. So just maybe specific, how are you trying to understand what's difficult? What are you doing about it? Okay. Um... Sure, I have to deliver that, but um, actually, I'm, I'm not sure I have to say, yeah. Uh, just... Sorry, what's that? You're not sure? Yeah, I'm not sure. That's it. just like, yeah, um, because sometimes, oh. yeah, I mean. 
uh, if we can just um, <laughs> sorry um, Okay, it's okay, Rafa. So I maybe there's some difficulty in understanding the challenge. I think that is uh, clear. But uh, since uh, Martin has said your group is on track to actually deploying everything and the submission is tomorrow, you can have the rest of the week to actually consult with someone like Martin and make sure you actually understood what was done during the group. This is uh, just to better prepare you for what's coming ahead. Okay, so I think we'll continue with the stand up. Sorry, and, and, uh, Anastasia, I just, want, I, would, I just want to jump in really quickly there, just okay. to emphasize what you said. Super important. Everyone, everyone here should be understanding what the entire group did. Just because one person did part of the work, it doesn't mean that everyone else shouldn't be understanding. So, it's important that uh, everyone understands. Um, so please, everyone, groups. If you're ahead of other people in your group. Part of your job is also to help other people explain. And if you don't understand uh, exactly what's going on, I would really encourage you to spend time, figure out, um, figure it out to a point that you can at least explain how it worked. Yeah. And if anyone in groups is not willing to explain something, please let us know. It's uh, super important. Yes, Martin. Uh, yeah, uh, thank you. I wanted to just uh, ask uh, quickly, where does somebody make the payment from? You can pay by PayPal, you can pay with a card. Those are the two options that we have. If you want to pay with a card, let us know and we'll send you a payment link. Oh, so you, uh, we just inbox like uh, at, uh, in, in Slack? You can send a message to train at and then we'll send you a payment link today or you can okay. pay by PayPal. Okay. Yeah. Okay, thank you, Martin, for asking that and Aaron for clarifying that. I hope that's clear now. So I think uh, we'll continue to another group. And uh, Nados, Nados, you had your hand up. Nados? Just give us... Um, Good morning. Good morning, okay. everyone. Good morning, Ados. Good morning. So, uh, with as we know, mentioned before, we've all divided our tasks. Some group work on the dashboard. And some on the modeling. And uh, so far, it's, it's going okay. It could be better. So we're facing some problems in the game, but I think it's something that, not, that can, it's something that can be fixed. So we're working on that and uh, in each other's work. So it's good to be in on the same page. Uh, so it's so far it's okay. We're going good. And, uh, some problems with the modeling, but we are working hard on fixing that. And concerning the career assignment, I've tried to submit some some questions. That I need guidance on, maybe I as some I need um, clarification on, maybe, and uh, the ones I think are my uh, my uh, uh, what is it something I'm not good at and something I want to improve. So I've added some questions so, and I've submitted. So yeah, that's my update. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, Nados, for actually submitting the career assignment. Just a question on uh, the the challenge for this week. You've said you are experiencing some problems with uh, modeling, and uh, you're saying you're trying your best. So, is there anything specific you're doing to actually ensure that you get it done? Anything specific, or you're just doing trial and errors until you get it done? Uh, to be honest, we're mostly trying. We're trying to. Uh, we're trying to use different motives, though uh, our predictions are not as we want them to be. So we're just for now we're trying mostly. Uh, everyone's okay, using so the same motives, so we're we're seeing uh, who has the best uh, outputs and everything. Oh, okay, I understand now. So it's more of tuning the models than actually doing modeling. Um, yeah. Yes, that is. 
Yes. Uh, okay, okay, that's nice. That is good um, progress from the group. So anyone else from group one who wants to add on to what Nadoso said? Anyone else from group one? Melako, Melako, I see you're on call. You're also from group one. Let's get from Melako. Then you did, yeah, I see you've raised your hand. Let's hear from Melako. Okay, good morning. Good morning, Melako. Uh, so, as Nardo said before, uh, we have divided the task into two groups, and uh, I was in the dashboard group. And uh, we have been working on the dashboard uh, front end. So uh, to test the dashboard, we have been uh, waiting from the modeling team to to give us uh, the result of the modeling, so can so that we can uh, try so so that we can test the dashboard functionality. So that's been with the challenge uh, regarding the career. I have uh, uh, I have money to uh, put some question on the career and assignment. And I think I have done that uh, with, uh, until the deadline. So that's uh, my progress. Okay, thank you, Melako, for also being able to do the career assignment. So I have uh, one question for you and uh, the dashboard. Um, the dashboard team from group one so you've said you've been waiting on the modeling team uh what have you been doing have you maybe been design, designing the front end or just been waiting for modeling so that you can comments what have you been doing while waiting uh no we have uh, we, we finished the front end part so we have been waiting the result of some models so can so that we can uh, try the dashboard uh so so far uh, the modeling uh, team has not uh, has not uh, produced a clear uh, a clear model that predict well so even uh, i think we have we are waiting for them so until that well uh, we are modifying the dashboard okay thank you melako so you did you had your hand up anything else you want to add apart from what has already been mentioned from group one Mm, hello. Uh, no, I have nothing to add more, but just uh, to mention one blocker. Uh, I, we are supposed, we were going to deploy our backing as well as our front end up to the cloud, but uh, especially on the backing, I think we have a blocker. Uh, only TensorFlow GPU has about the size of TensorFlow GPU has, is about 500 megabytes and more. And for free deployments, the maximum uh, size is about 500 megabytes. And do you might have an issue on the deployment side of the backend or the modeling part. Okay, so I don't know if uh, if Yebebal is here. Okay, so that has been noted, Didia. I think uh, if uh, we can help unblocking that issue, we'll reach out to you from mm. Slack. So, yeah, you, you did. Can you just post it on Slack? So let's let's reactivate Slack as a method of communication. So if it's mentioned here, yeah, well, it's not on the call. So why not uh, write it on Slack, tag him, and let's... Um, you may not be the only one with that issue. Sure. Yeah. Uh, okay, and one more question uh, regarding the payment. Uh, is it okay for each Ethiopians to pay directly using the mobile application and send a screenshot instead of uh, getting the receipt from the banks, from local banks? So what's important for us is twofold. One is that the money arrives, and the second is is that, is that it's provable. Beyond that, I'm not, um, yeah, I'm not fully aware of um, whether I, I can't advise you on which is more secure, using the mobile app versus going to a bank. But we need the money has to arrive, and we have to have that proof. So beyond that, I'm not the right person to ask. As far as I understand, mobile apps work equally well. But yeah, that's. Um, so the money should arrive and it, we should have some proof. Mm -hmm. But screenshot from a phone if the money arrives seems fine to me. Okay, all right. Thank you. Okay, thank you for that, Didier and Aaron.
again. So I think we'll proceed to the next team. That's enough from Group One. A good work, Group One. So I think uh, Biniam, Biniam, you had your hand raised. All right. Can you hear me, Anastasia? Yes, I can hear you clearly. Okay. Good morning, Anastasia, and everyone. So, to give you an update on my team's progress, uh, uh, we we've been actually working on the project uh, in two teams. Initially, we were just uh, we uh, we divided up the tasks uh, among ourselves uh, using the subtasks specified in the project uh, document. Uh, but after we started working on task two and three. We created two separate teams that works on the task series, which means a deployment team dashboard part in uh, task two, uh, the others. Uh, so uh, we've been struggling with developing a working model for a while, but uh, yeah, since yesterday, we've been able to uh, deliver a model, but there is still a tuning issue. We're not getting the accurate prediction we're expecting. Uh, so we're going to be working on that. But uh, on that note, we've been, uh, uh, there is also another issue be, which has to do with uh, processing time. It's taking a long time just to run one experiment, uh, which means uh, there will not be enough time to run enough experiments and uh, tune the hyperparameters into something, uh, uh, you know, something highly accurate. So uh, the way we're going about solving that issue is uh, where everyone is running uh, different experiment on their machines uh, uh, in trying to come up with working model on their own. And finally, we will decide on uh, the one that's uh, more accurate than the other. So uh, if the AWS nation was, machine was working for us, that would have been better. But uh, for some reason, it's taking a long time to run it on the AWS machine as well for us. So that has been an issue for us. Uh, so I think that's where we start. Okay, thank you, Biniam, for that. So I do have a few follow-up questions, but uh, before I start, maybe how are you on the careers? I don't think you've given us. A yeah, okay. Uh, all right, so regarding the career ex uh, assignment, I was actually excited, excited about the about it. Uh, I had a lot of questions uh, in the one-to-one -one session will be a lot helpful, I believe. So uh, I've managed to submit uh, uh, four questions, although I have a lot more than that. So just uh, for this session, uh, uh, I've selected uh, the top four, I believe are important to me. So that's where I am. Okay, uh, that's good. So just the follow-up questions, especially on the modeling, you've mentioned that AWS is not working for your team, maybe as expected. Have you tried to reach out uh, to your tutors? You are sent to Yabebal and Musa. Have you tried to reach out to either of them, maybe see what the issue is, how it can be sorted? Yeah, uh, Yabebal tried to help us out yesterday. Uh, also, he mentioned that we've been a bit late uh, with uh, reaching out to him with the issue. Uh, he's right, uh, we should have uh, reached out earlier, but uh, the problem is uh, that my instance, specifically my instance is not uh, operational at all. Uh, for some reason, I've, I haven't been able to access the GPU. Uh, for the others, all, all, I think the GPU is working, but uh, we haven't been able to load the data completely in uh, the cloud and then uh, run the pre-processing. The, the actual problem is, uh, is not the modeling part, uh, but the pre-processing part. Uh, for some reason, it's taking way too long uh, to finish the pre-processing the processing the data and uh, preparing it for the modeling part. Uh, but I think uh, one of my team members uh, suggested something uh, that might work uh, on our meeting uh, before the, the on our uh, morning meeting today. So. Uh, we're hoping that we'll implement that and solve the issue. So, yeah. Okay, Biniam. So I hope that so whatever you've you've the plan will work. But if it doesn't, make sure you actually be in contact with Yabebal and or Musa, and uh, have the AWS working because I think it's really crucial 
for this project to have that processing time. So anyone else from Binium's team, maybe someone working on the dashboard, we get what's happening on that team. Anyone working on the dashboard from group five? Binium, who is working on the dashboard? Maybe just a name. You can have uh, anyone. Yeah. Uh couple of our team members were working on it. One is Jeremy, the other one's ABC Lom, so uh, I'm not sure if they are in the meeting. Uh, yeah, I don't think they are in the meeting. Uh, just, but to give you an update, uh, we had, uh, as I just told you, we had a, a meeting before this one. Uh, so they updated me that they have completed the dashboard part and they're just waiting for us to give them a working model so they can deploy it. Uh, we'll be uh, integrating in, uh, that into the dashboard uh, later on. So, yeah. Okay. Thank you, Biniam. Okay. So next, I think we'll go to Tesfai. Tesfai had his hand raised up. That should be group. Group two. Yes, group two. Yes, yeah. Tesfai. So, hello, everyone. Good morning. Um, so, as I mentioned on the last standard, uh, we have divided our tasks into three, the modeling, backend, and uh, front-end team. Uh, we had problems with the modeling part, but uh, uh, it seems okay for now. So, every as every team has given us the okay, they're okay to uh, combine everything today and uh, see if everything works. So, uh, the backend, front-end, and modeling uh, teams have given us their okay so it's, it's a good uh, sign and uh, we will combine it today and uh, come up with the uh, complete project so by the end of the day uh, that's uh, the update on the team on the uh, career exercise i saw it really late but uh, i had like uh, two hours or so to uh, review everything and uh, come up with the questions that i wanted to ask and uh, submit it on time so i did that as well so yeah it's good. Okay, thank you, Tesfai. I think that Tesfai, did you find that useful? The process of quietly sitting and reflecting, or do you think? I mean, if you had just gone into the meeting cold versus thinking beforehand, did it make a difference? Uh, yeah, it does. It it really does because you 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 have to combine everything, so you have to choose which one to ask. So I just go through the, again, on the three real world problems so that uh, those are the jobs that I wanted and uh, I, I have to uh, find those boxes where I want to fit in so that I, I chose those areas that I wanted and uh, come up with only some uh, specific tasks that I want to accomplish with Ten Academy. So uh, it, 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 has, uh, it has helped me manage my questions so that uh, in 15 minutes, we can have a really good conversation. Yeah, no, I just want to emphasize this again, not for the one-on-ones per se, but when you get into yeah. the world of work, don't go into these meetings cold. Your manager's time is valuable. Yeah. And if you just show up and say, tell me what to do, you're only getting 20% yeah. of what you could be getting. So I'm happy that you put the time into it. Yeah. Okay, thank you, Tesfai. I think that was a really nice and brief for what's going on in Group 2. Anyone else from Group 2 who has anything to add before we proceed? Abel? Abel, I see you in the meeting. Yes, Abel. Okay, hello, everyone. Hello. Mm. So we have been working on the module. We have been working on the module for the past three days. It's been difficult and we have been working on it for a long time. But uh, yesterday we, we finished the part and uh, we are looking forward to evaluate the module with different metrics. And uh, also we are working on the dashboard deployment uh, part. And for the career assignment, uh, I prepared the uh, questions to ask uh, the tutors and I submitted the questions last night on G class. So yeah, that's what I have. Okay, thank you, Abel. It's uh, good to hear that even though you're having difficulties, you're actually making progress. Okay, so I think that will summarize it for group two and now we are left with um, group four.
Do we have anyone from Group 4 around to actually give out what's going on there? Group 4 volunteers. Hello. Yes, Yona. Uh, so uh, yesterday, uh, I was, me and uh, Dinamo was uh, doing on uh, the training, model training. Uh, Unfortunately, like my machine was not able to do like last night, but I uh, got some OS issues, so I'm just waiting to uh, train it on the AWS. I was uh, trying to train it from my machine first with a uh, few data, so uh, but Dynamo was uh, able to train his model, so he was waiting for. Uh, uh, the result of the training, uh, the dashboard front end and back end was done. We are uh, uh, ahead of like, integrating the back end with the front end, then uh, fit the model. So uh, yesterday, your progress was uh, like this. Any feedback from your side on careers? Sorry, I haven't heard. Sorry? I haven't heard what it is. You, you did not do the career assignment. Is that what you're saying? Oh, no, I, I, I have done. I have uh, done and submitted, like last night. Uh, I have prepared three questions and reviewed Thank my you. performance for the past three weeks and including this, the fourth one. Uh, so I have three questions uh, submitted, then uh, maybe I will raise all of them during my one-on-one -on -one session. Okay, thank you, Jonas. So maybe just one question for your group, group four. Uh, is there a way you've, maybe you've divided the work, the modeling, the dashboard, how many people, how many groups are there within the group? How are you working as a team to actually ensure that everything is done by tomorrow? Yeah, uh, the dashboard and uh, the, the front end and back end is assigned to two people, Dynamo and uh, uh, Daisy. So uh, the rest of us are working on the modeling part. We were uh, having trouble, so we were trying to uh, fix it by our own, then discuss uh, like this afternoon, so so that like, we will have a model for the uh, dashboard team. Okay, thank you, thank you, Jonas. So, do we have anyone else from Group Four who has anything to add? Preferably someone from the modeling modeling team. I think Mark has... Yeah. Yes, dear. Dear, uh, you are working on Dashboard, but okay, just go ahead, give us your update. Mm, okay, so good morning, everyone. Good morning. So uh, I was currently assigned uh, to work on the backend. Um, uh, there was not much going on in the backend, so uh, it didn't take much time to, uh, to develop the backend, so I finished it and... Uh, uh, I expected a model to be uh, delivered, but uh, the modeling team was uh, in trouble coming up with a model uh, which, is, which, which, which predicts uh, with uh, much greater accuracy. So I joined up uh, with the modeling team and uh, currently I'm waiting for uh, one of my models to finish building. It took so much time, so it was running all night and uh, still didn't finish. So. I expect this model to perform very well, so I'm waiting for its output. Um, and regarding the careers assignment, uh, yesterday after uh, I received the document, uh, I just went through it and uh, scheduled my meeting late uh, so, I could, uh, so I could prepare before uh, uh, the meeting. I didn't know there was a submission due yesterday. So I was expecting to finish, um, to, to prepare for the meeting 
uh, today uh, morning and uh, just uh, go with the meeting. And I didn't know, I just found out that there was a deadline yesterday. Oh, okay. Uh, sorry for that. I think uh, you would be able to just be able to prepare before your time for the one on one. And uh, so, something else for group four I've only noticed that there's only two of you in the stand up. Maybe just find out from your other group members what's going on because two out of eight people that is quite um, quite low. Okay, so that covers it for all the groups. Uh, we have today so I'll just leave a room open for anyone who has any other question any other addition you just recap the announcements Anastasia okay so I'll do the announcements the ones I said at the beginning but I'll just say them again so we do have the one-on-ones meeting today they are the first ones for this group and uh, just ensure that you actually have a time slot. You've, uh, you've been, links have been sent to you, so just ensure that you've actually booked a time slot if you've not booked and uh, keep be on time because it's as Aaron keeps mentioning, we are preparing you for the professional work and uh, just be on time to your one-on-ones. Secondly, it's the contracts. They are due today. Ensure that you sign them. The links have been attached to the Google Classroom, so just make sure that you, it's not another repetition of I didn't say it, I didn't know. They are due today, just make sure you actually do the contracts. And, uh, and finally, uh, the, the deposits should be done today. And as Aaron has mentioned, you can do your payments through PayPal, or if you're going to do using the card, you can just email train at tenacademy.org for the payment link. So any other announcement from uh, the Ten Academy team? You can take them now. Nothing from my side. Just hope everyone's doing well. And I'm really looking forward to the opportunity to speak with half of you guys today. Okay, thank you, Arun. Any other announcement from the tutors, from the careers team? Okay, so I'll assume that everyone is uh, okay. So thank you for attending today's stand-up. Have a good day and uh, all the best on your one-on-ones. Thank you.